Once again, I'm joined by my buddy Adam. We brought out the kitchen sink and set a jumbo spread of about 10 dozen decoys in hopes of convincing some weary ducks to commit. We have a good win that will help bring the decoy spread to life, and to hide, we're using the Invisiman blinds as layout blinds on dry ground. It's a cloudy, misty morning, and it feels very ducky. If everything goes as planned, we will end up with a few birds in the bag. Good morning, guys. We're set up in the marsh, and we have a bunch of decoys out there. A lot. Like, I don't even know how many we put out. But uh, we got Adam with me today. We're gonna be hiding in these Invisimans. Uh, legs folding down, and we're just gonna use them as a layout blind. And hopefully, things will work in our favor today. We got a nice wind, um, basically no moon tonight. So I don't know if the birds were night feeding or what. So hopefully things have changed from the last time I hunted and uh, we could shoot some birds today. I got, I got some high hopes, but I'm prepared for the worst. <laughs> um, but can't complain about a good wind, good hide, and a big old spread. I think something's gonna happen. About time to uh, get loaded up here. I'm gonna be shooting these, if it'll focus. These are Remington Nitro Steel 4s out of the old 20 gauge today. That's how we know that I'm gonna kill them all. That's, oh yeah? Hey, they can't even see you. Three and a half inch triple Bs. You're not shooting three and a half inch triple Bs. Oh. But, <laughs> um, yeah, I wanna give a shout out to OnX for uh, being such a great platform for hunters. So if you guys are looking for the perfect tool for a public land hunter, check out Onyx. Uh, I use it personally to mark spots in the marsh that I like to go to, and I also use it to uh, f figure out the best way to get to spots with the line distance tool. So if I'm walking in and I've got multiple ways of going, I can figure out which way is the best by using that line distance tool. But we're gonna, well, we got probably five minutes left until shooting time. Something like that. I guess I got my yeah. phone right here. Five minutes. We got five minutes exactly. So we're gonna You're throw kidding. these tetras in. You guys asked me about my hearing protection. Tetra Alpha Shields, that's what I use. And uh, we will sit here and wait for some ducks. Come on. Don't land over there. Here we go, crossing right in front. We should have shot. Maybe I'll come back. Maybe. Come back over here. There's short stuff over here. It's right here. I saw it underwater. <laughs> Should have grabbed it. I kicked it. Well, it was like two feet underwater. Oh, like On the board, hen pintail. We, uh, had a few opportunities to shoot it that we should have, <clears throat> but the way it's working, or the way that bird was working, it makes sense that it was a pintail. So I'm I'm happy. Got the pintail for the day. It dove underwater. <clears throat> I went to the same spot it dove. I saw it under the water. I kicked it, and uh, it stayed underwater for quite a, quite a bit longer. And it came back up. And we were able to get it. So super happy about that but we'll get back in the blind and hopefully see some more. Did you even see that one? I heard it and I looked up and saw it. A little diver. And then you killed it. <laughs> <laughs> you stop. We got a little diver, a little ring neck, blackjack. But Adam, on, in all honesty, Adam and I were probably just both on our phones. I was, I was <laughs> playing Candy Crush. I was playing Tower Defense. Yeah, 
I play Candy Crush, he plays Balloon Tower Defense. <laughs> and I just hear a sploosh, and there's, he's sitting right in the spread. Oh well, hey, <laughs> that's just how it goes. What, comment down below, on a slow day, what is your favorite game on your phone to play? I'm curious, I'm always looking for some new ones, so let me know down in the comments. Balloon's Tower Defense is way better than Candy Crush. I don't have to pay. I don't have to run out of lives and have to pay for them. I don't pay. For I know them. you don't pay for them, but you're always out of lives. Maybe that's a good thing though, because then you pay more attention. Yes. I never run out of lives, so I can just play constantly. <laughs> Big group, four of them. Uh -huh. <laughs> more. Yep. We'll land these two. Four are coming back. Two are coming back. I don't even know what those are. I might have to take shots to get one. Yeah. Ready? Shoot him at him. You got one. Yeah. One Susie. That group didn't want to finish right. They uh, skirted the edge of the decoys. Got old Susie. She made me cook. I had to work for this one. But that brings me up to three. Adam, what? Explain yourself. <laughs> I don't. I don't have any excuses. <laughs> I know. He he had a chip shot at a mallard drake that was like toes in the water. No, it was it it stopped about. It was pretty high up, but it was. No, the group that I killed that one out of. Uh -oh. Yeah, you, you should have gotten shot at when you were gone. I'm surprised you didn't get one. Oh, uh, dude, I'm not. No. I can hit everything when I'm not with you. I think it's the cameras. I could have used the dog on that retrieve. That would have been nice. <laughs> but I don't know how much longer we'll give it. Maybe another hour. I think Lauren said to be home at noon. So maybe we'll give it 30 minutes. We'll give it. We'll give it 30 more minutes. Hopefully, we'll get another group to come by. Yeah, Adam needs a redemption. He is not showing YouTube his uh Dude, I hit everything shooting. I shot at yes. I swear to God, none of you saw it, but I hunted without Josh yesterday, and I hit everything I shot at. Today, I shouldn't say everything. I didn't hit everything I shot at. Today, I hit nothing I shot at. Last time I hunted with Josh, I hit nothing I shot at. <laughs> it's okay. We'll get you another one. Well, it would be okay if I wasn't shooting like $5 bills every time because ammo's so expensive now. Come on. That's all you. Shoot him. Hey. You better load up. He's still up. That's a widgeon. Yeah, I know. Nice. 
But hey, I hit something. I let him land though first. Yeah, better get on him. Go that way. I'm tying tangled. I'm tangled. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. You did it. Look what I did. Look what I did. Let me see it. Very nice. It's a girl. It's a girl. <laughs> You got all tangled up in the spreader. Oh, dude, I was so tangled. <laughs> and you know the little piece of elastic that comes off the string? Yeah. It was wrapped around my foot. <laughs> it was bad. You saw that duck before I did. You're like, come on. Come on. <laughs> I wasn't going to say anything to you. I wanted to shoot it. I didn't want to give you a chance. <laughs> come on. I'm like, oh, there's a duck. <laughs> it's all you, Adam. I've never felt so happy for hitting a bird in my life. Ever. <laughs> Where is it? Right here. <laughs> yeah, baby. That's the one right there. I wasn't paying attention. No, Adam's I wasn't going to let Josh shoot. Adam, Adam was saying, come on, come on. I'm like, what are you? Oh, there's a duck. Oh, it's right there. You did it. Good job. It's good. It's been pretty decent today. We're up to four birds. I can still hit stuff. Adam can hit stuff. He switched out to a modified choke, and it seems to help him. <laughs> Instead of shooting a super tight patterning choke. So, Which is awesome. That choke's off. Hopefully within the next 20 minutes we'll get another look by a duck, so we'll see. Hey, are you sponsored by Rogers? I wish. Rogers, hit me up again. I mean, we can go back to the old days. <laughs> yeah, not a bad hunt, wouldn't you say? We've had worse. We've done more for less. The most excited I've ever been to shoot a bird. Yeah, Adam was very excited to shoot this little widgeon. I have yet to shoot a widgeon this year, so I shot two. Good right job. There. Chase this one down. Had to chase this one down. I need Cora to hurry up and get a little bit older so she can hunt. So then I'm not having to walk through all that deep water. <laughs> we really could have used her today. She would have been great. But you know, four ducks to end it off. Not bad. Not bad. Could be better. Could be worse. 60 something degrees today. So can't complain. It's the best day I've had all week. So that's good. <laughs> But that's it for today. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave me a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And uh, make sure to go follow me on social media, listen to the podcast, all that good stuff. And I'll catch you on the next one.